I feel like I'm actually settled in almost or like I've been thinking about good times So tell me I am both sides I believe in the fucking time For the sake of time Just give me the eye I've been thinking about I said don't blow my high I'm on that carpet ride I've been swerving, I'm a servant to my magic side. I was in a, it's a petty crime. You see how people change their vibe when it's green up on their mind. Kevin fed a lot, purchased what my curses in between these verses. How I really feel. Time. So tell me, are you both sides? I've been thinking about good times. For the sake of time. Hi guys, welcome to our very first settling in vlog. Sorry if you can hear that in the back, but this is what the whole vlog is about this week. We're gonna spend a week in our lives working, living, and settling into our new apartment. So we have a lot of new things coming for the apartment this week, starting with this, which is our new bar cart. This is Thomas, my boyfriend. Ooh, I'm so excited. You guys, this is our new bar cart. We got a gold one and it's gonna go right there. I'm so excited. Anyways, I just wanted to start this vlog and say hello. Let's build this bar cart and then go get the rest of our things. But today's Tuesday. I just finished work and yeah, welcome to the vlog. washi tape so that I would measure out like how far it would go on this wall. So that's why this is there. But that was really easy to put together once we actually found. Ooh, I oh my gosh, I think it's the perfect size. <gasps> oh my gosh, you guys, the place is coming more and more together. I'm so happy. It looks so good. I love that the gold matches the touch of gold here. And then eventually we're gonna get a gold mirror to replace this black one. You guys, I think this looks so nice. My wine glasses are actually still at my old place, so I need to get those. But we're gonna put like a table lamp right here and then the wine, wine glasses. It'll be so pretty. Oh my God, I love it. I also wanna give you guys an overview of how the place looks right now. So here is our entryway. We have like a little tree entry coat rack thing, which will be really nice just because we have like our everyday shoes here, our slippers, and then are like everyday bags. Now they don't have to live on a counter or anything. They can just be on this tree rack, which will be really nice. The bathroom is really nothing different. This is just how the bathroom looks. The under sink organization looks really nice. I haven't showed you guys in the last couple vlogs, but we did get these bathroom organizers from Amazon and the bottom one pulls out. So that's really nice. The entryway looks like this. We still have to get a second shoe rack. And then I don't think the, I don't know, maybe the frame will stay there. I'm not sure, but Here's how the entryway is looking. Bedroom looks all the same. Thomas's wardrobe, my closet, my old mirror is here. And eventually we're gonna get something to put like my makeup and stuff, but this is where the old mirror went. And then here's the living room, so pretty. This is our newest thing that we built in our last vlog. So make sure you guys check out the last moving vlog. But this Besta from Ikea is so beautiful. It's so pretty. I love it so, so much. We have our floor length mirror here from Ikea. This is so big and it was under $200. Couch and stuff is all the same. And yeah, oh my gosh. And in this vlog, you guys, we are gonna basically like finish the apartment pretty close to done by the end of this. Our dining table is gonna come. Our bar stools are already here. New office chair will be here and two dining chairs, because we're just testing out. We're gonna get four eventually, but we got two, which should hopefully arrive by the end of the week, but our dining table will come and that like will really make this place feel pretty done. Oh my God, the bar cart is so pretty. We need light here anyways. That's where like the old floor lamp was. So that's a new bar cart. I will link this below for you guys. This is from Wayfair and it was pretty affordable. The two things left that we have to get today that already arrived are the bar stools, which I'm so excited for. They match the backsplash, which will be really nice. I'm just glad because we don't have any chairs here. So we've just been like eating at the couch or like at the counter like this. So I'm really excited to get those, but the bar cart looks so nice. 
Oh my god, you guys. I feel like I rushed the beginning of that intro, but if you guys are new here, my name is Jenna. I'm 25 years old. I'm moving in with my boyfriend for the first time. We live in Arlington, Virginia. I work in corporate at a CPA firm, and Thomas is about to start medical school. So we're trying to finish this apartment as quickly as possible because I just want this place to feel done when he starts school so that there's like kind of nothing else to work on and he can start school, come home, and feel relaxed. So that's kind of why we've been rushing in this like settling in process, moving in process and everything. But I hope you guys stick around. I post a lot of work week in my life vlogs and just like coming along life with me as just a regular human, living a regular life, working, having a partner, living with them for the first time. And later on in this vlog, I wanna to talk to you guys more about like the transition of actually living with your partner for the first time and like moving in with them. Because I've had some realizations in the last couple of days since Thomas and I have started living together. If you guys don't know, I lived alone in an apartment last year for a whole year. And Thomas stayed with me like probably 85% of the time. Like he was there a lot, but we weren't fully, you know, committed to lease together. So I wanna to talk to you guys about that later on in this vlog. But for now, we need to make the bar stools and eat dinner and stuff. So that's just what's to come for this vlog. And yeah, I hope you guys stick around. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Just hit me. Yeah, so this is like the sapphire blue and it's like velvet. This is technically from All Modern, which is like the Wayfair like sister brand or something. But these are called the Cody bar stools. The whole vibe for this apartment, you guys, is mid-century modern with pops of blue. So it's like woods, pop of color, gold, black, and stuff. So I think this will look really nice as long as it's high enough. I got so many things to say to you. I wanna be the one to make a move. And if you can't decide, I can change your mind. I feel some new kind of motion. You guys, I think it looks so pretty with the backsplash. I love it. Oh my God, it matches. It's so pretty. This was also the perfect height too. I was nervous that it wasn't gonna be tall enough, but it definitely is tall enough. Like, look, oh my God. Now I can sit and eat. That was actually really easy too. Those were like the two like simplest things to put together. 6.30 now, so Thomas and I are gonna eat and chill. And then I'll put a time lapse of us making the second office chair. We, in the last vlog, we got an office chair from Costco, but we had to return it because it just wasn't good enough. It just like felt uncomfortable for $100. So we got a second one from Amazon and it's pretty similar to my office chair now. So we're gonna do that at some point later, but I just got off work and then built these two things and now I'm hungry. So I'm just glad that I was able to get off at like a normal time today. I got off right at like 5.30, so that's good. So now we're gonna make Caesar salads for dinner and just chill and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit, but we hit this apartment vlog off hard. glasses from my old apartment so we're using these travel wine things but at least it's for wine you know Get more than the Costco one? Oh. <laughs> a ton better? Yeah. Ooh, it looks nice. Oh my god, it matches with mine. Yeah, I chose a color like that on purpose. Oh, yay. Ooh, 
comfy. Ooh. Yay. Okay. I used to never put down the blinds until I got comments on my videos and they were like, put down the blinds. And I was like, you're right. <laughs> so now I put down the blinds. It's been a couple of hours. I wanted to go on a long walk after dinner. Didn't happen because it was like drizzling. And then I was in such a cranky mood and Thomas was like, just go to the gym and just walk. And I was like, you're right. So I did that and I'm actually really excited because I'm gonna start a new workout program on the Alive app. They're like launching this new program where everyone starts at the same time. And I forget what it's called. like alive and thrive it's a 45 day program so like not like a million weeks or whatever it was 45 days how long is 45 days like six weeks six is doable i think six is enough to be like okay i'm back in the habit of working out and like going to the gym and stuff so i'm actually really excited that starts on august 1st so yeah welcome back to the gym to me for tonight i just walked and now it's like 10 o'clock I guess I should just go to bed even though I'm not tired whatsoever. But we're like done with everything for the apartment as of tonight. I wanted to go to my old apartment to pick up my wine glasses and stuff, but I'll just do that tomorrow. I'm so excited. The bar cart looks so good, you guys. Don't you think so? Okay, well, I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. I'm actually going to the office tomorrow too because I just didn't get a lot done today working from home and it's reminding me why I like to go to the office. So I'm gonna do that. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good night. guys happy wednesday i just got dressed and ready for work i need to like do my hair and makeup but good morning i went to the gym this morning and i just walked on incline it feels so good to be back on like a slight routine like the greens is how i know i'm on any type of routine because i love those but good morning let's go to work i'm gonna go to the office today because like i told you guys i felt like i wasn't really as productive as i wanted to be yesterday so i'm gonna go in today hopefully that helps and We'll get a lot done. I'll show you guys my finished outfit and stuff once I do my hair and put on some mascara, but let's get ready. I need to use my Dyson. that took longer than I wanted it to. It's literally like 8.20, I gotta go. I gotta go to work. Here's my complete look and outfit today. This is a top from the store Four Days. They're a sustainable brand, a closed loop brand, just all really good things. And I love this because it's like a longer short sleeve and then I'm wearing my Princess Polly green archer pants. I just got them tailored because I'm like too short for them. So now they're finally like the perfect length for me. And yeah, that's my finished look. I will never get over like fresh hair days. It's just like actually life altering. <laughs> I'm gonna make my breakfast, show you guys what I'm making. I'm making like protein yogurt because I, I had it yesterday and it's so good, you guys. I'm gonna put the recipe on the screen as I make it. It is literally amazing. You guys have to try it. You have to. So let's go make that and go to the office. <laughs> This protein yogurt tastes like, it doesn't taste like protein yogurt, it just tastes like vanilla yogurt, peaches, cinnamon, oatmeal. It's so freaking good. Please, 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 please. Of all the things that I've made with protein, you have to try this, it's so good. Okay, I will see you guys after work. And I don't think there's anything coming for the apartment today. So this is just like a regular day in this week in my life, Wednesday. <laughs> okay, have a good day. Look at my hair, it's so pretty. Okay. 
Seriously. You made a chair? Okay, let's see. Oh my gosh, whoa. You guys, the flexi spot desk, Thomas's desk came while I was at work. It literally arrived in like one day, which is crazy. But look at it. Whoa. Now we're matching. We're matching. I had a fine day. I, was, I also was not very productive at work today. I just, I don't know. But it's over, so who cares? Also, my mom told me that she wants the TV stand. So we're gonna take this home this weekend. But also the dining chairs came. So we'll make that later, but we just have lots of boxes and stuff going on. And then I wanna show you guys. Look at this, oh my God, this is so pretty. Thomas's sister gifted us a rice cooker. It's so pretty, it's a cuckoo. So pretty, thank you so much, Stephanie, if you're watching this. I love it there. I didn't realize you're gonna get right back on 70. Yeah, I had therapy, but I finished a little early today. Okay, well we're gonna eat and then we'll make the dining chairs. The dining table I think is supposed to, it's supposed to be coming tomorrow, but it hasn't moved from Texas in like a couple days. So I don't know. But the desk was a big apartment update. I'm so happy. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> I still think these should be closer together. Okay, which one do you want? Which side do you want to? Will you just move them both closer together? I guess we should move yours. Okay. Does that look good? Oh, I like it. Oh, you want it that close together to the desk? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, I like how that looks. Whoa, whoa, careful. But yeah, we need a monitor stand. I just want it to look like very similar to each other. Ooh, I like it, you guys. What do you think? I think this looks really, really nice. And like the fact that we still have all of this space for the dining table, I think it's gonna feel so complete after we have that. We went to my old apartment to pick up a couple of things. I know I say this probably every time, but I really, really think there's like maybe one trip left. The only things left that we have to get from our apartment now are that gold and black accent side table that's gonna go in the bedroom and the Missy Already neon sign. I think that really is the only things that we have left to get from there. We just didn't have space today. We just brought like a bunch of random kind of junk that we need, like my extra contacts, extra tampons our wine glasses and all my bottles of wine now and just like some extra bathroom things. So I'm gonna unpack that, figure out these boxes and then if we have time, we'll build the dining chairs but it's, it's like 9.52 so we're like tired. Maybe I'll do it in the morning, I don't know. We're trying to figure out like the lighting situation. So Thomas thinks a light would work best here in the nook area. I kind of think that a lamp would look nice here on the bar cart. Either way, it's kind of dark here at night. Eventually when we get a dining table, which should come this week, we wanna get a lamp that will go like an arched lamp on the dining table. So that will help with like the lighting in this area. Oh, the neon sign here? Or like Thomas just said, we could put the neon Miss You Already sign Right here, that's such a good idea. That'd be so cute, but that's like what people usually do. They put the neon sign in the bar area. I really like this, you guys. I feel like it's like the perfect mid-century modern, like looks expensive, but it was actually under $100 for each one. And I think it looks really good. I think it was kind of a pain to put together. I thought it was gonna be easier than it was, but it looks actually like it had a lot of parts, but it's really pretty. I think it's really nice. Honestly, we're really tired. So I think we're gonna stop and finish the second one tomorrow morning. And hopefully the dining table will come tomorrow. I don't know if it will. You can never really tell with shipping and stuff these days, but at least one of the chairs is done. And we have a floor lamp coming tomorrow from Amazon that will go next to the TV stand. And then, yeah. We unpacked most of the things from my old place too. You guys saw the bar cart and I just have to put some like bathroom stuff away. 
So I think that's all we're gonna do tonight. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. I'm not going to the office. I'm working from home tomorrow just because I just want the extra time. So yeah. Hi guys, I just wanna take a quick break and show you guys these three new pieces that were gifted to me by Nisolo. Thank you so much Nisolo for these items. I can't wait to show you guys. They're actually also a sustainable brand. Nisolo is one of those brands that has the environment at the center of their mission, which I think is really cool. Every Nisolo purchase ensures a living wage to 100% of the people that are working in their factories, which I think is really cool because they're not only offsetting carbon emissions and helping the environment, but they also care so much about people. Every Nisolo purchase comes with a sustainability facts sheet so you can see how it affects people and how it affects the planet and I just need to show you guys these really cute new shoes. I love these shoes so much. They are just like, I have never seen a pair of shoes like this ever in my life. And they're so comfortable. They're very natural looking. They're very neutral. So I'm really excited to wear these. These are the first pair of shoes. I'll link these in the description box. And they come in a bunch of different colors too. I just chose this neutral rosy tone color block. And then for my second pair of shoes, I just got these really cute basic woven sandals. These are just the perfect everyday sandal. If you want to keep something open toe, if you want to look a little bit more casual, I just think these are so cute and i just think it's really nice to wear sustainable shoes that not only care about the planet but also the people that like put in their effort to make these shoes too these are so cute these also come in different colors i just wanted the black because i don't have a pair of black slide sandals so this is the second pair and then lastly i want to show you guys this little shopping tote Okay, first of all, this is just like the cutest everyday tote ever. I love it so much because it's actually a really nice everyday size. You can wear it with the short straps as like a little tote bag, or it also comes with a longer handle so that you can wear it as a crossbody too. I don't have anything like this either. And I, I just love the more like natural look that it has. And yeah, I think it's really nice. Thank you again, Nacello, for gifting me these items. I'll leave a link in the description box to all of these items and more about Nacello if you wanna learn more about them. I think that's everything. Let's get back to the video. morning guys happy thursday it feels like friday but it's not it's because i usually work from home on only fridays but i'm working from home today but i need to get off right at five to meet a friend who's visiting if you guys can guess you're probably right you'll see him later but i need to like start i had to start work early just because i want to make sure i get everything done by the time i get off right at five so hello it's actually like noon i i filmed me taking my greens with you guys but, but that was at like seven and then i basically just like drank coffee and started work and now i'm taking like a break to talk to you guys thomas is getting coffee downstairs it's really nice because our new building has like free coffee downstairs we made the chairs you guys these are the most beautiful chairs actually ever and they were under a hundred dollars each which from wayfair and even amazon they're more than that so i'm gonna link them for you guys they're from target and they're absolutely stunning and they feel so comfortable i keep telling thomas they're like even more comfortable than they look like i feel like they look pretty rigid but they're actually so nice and soft it comes in four different colors too this is like the beige linen fabric but then there's also fake leather my video is actually premiering right now the like move-in day vlog and you guys are giving me so many amazing comments and it just reminds me of what i wanted to talk to you guys about in this like settling in vlog but just don't forget you guys i'm showing you like the highlights of moving and i'm trying to do my best to show you guys like the realistic moments of thomas and i like talking things through building things like putting stuff together packing and unpacking but i just want to like put it out there for anyone that probably is the same way i am not my best self moving i think i talked about this like i think i said that in my week in my life moving a previous moving vlog but i'm impatient and i don't like assembling things and i'm very picky about the stuff that i own so moving was hard because i felt if i felt like something might have gotten scuffed somewhere I was in a bad mood or if i felt like something wasn't being assembled the right way or quick enough or like correctly i would just get so easily frustrated even with thomas i'm like adjusting to this time in my life where there's no longer one brain deciding things for the apartment it's not me living alone anymore or thomas like staying at my place but it's thomas and i living here together which means we make decisions together there's two brains two different approaches a lot of the time for the simplest things like if we need to bring the furniture dolly to the car if i didn't think we needed to since i lived alone i just knew that there wasn't really anyone else to like disagree i guess but if thomas thought so and i didn't it's just it creates a little bit of like tension i guess or frustration i was talking about this with my therapist and i'm in definitely like an adjustment 
period and transition period in my life where I really want to be respectful to Thomas and I've been catching myself being short, being snappy, just because I want the place to be done and everything. I just wanted to like put it out there like the moving vlogs are so so fun but there's definitely moments where I'm like not my best self and I don't know how much of that I actually got on camera but moving sucks. I hate moving. I like furnishing I guess and like not even putting things together. I like having a complete space, which is why I want to furnish it so quickly, but moving sucks. I just have to say that. And Thomas is really sweet to be so patient and nice and calm, which is like really what I need. Otherwise, like it would just be explosive in here all the time. So he really grounds me and he really like is really patient with me when I'm feel pretty short in my responses. And my therapist is actually really helpful in telling me that like before I respond to something, in regards to the apartment take like three deep breaths or count to five or imagine the stop sign doing those things behaviorally before i respond will allow me to not be so short and have like a tone or anything and i can be as patient as he is with me so that's it that's my rant i need to go back to work but i i'm reading like the comments during the live and you guys are so nice telling me like Oh, this looks so fun. I hate moving, but yours looks really fun. But don't worry, you guys. Like, there are moments where I hated it, too. Okay, I ranted too long. I'm gonna go back to work. I'll talk to you guys later. I don't know if the dining table is even coming today, but we do have a lamp coming today. So, settling in more. Tom just wants to target. While I was working and look what he got because I asked him for something sweet. Reese's Thins. We're gonna keep these in the fridge and these cookies. <gasps> Lavender shortbread. And then our lamp came, but we're gonna make it probably tonight just so that you guys can see what it looks like with like the lighting at night and stuff. But I'm so excited. I'm gonna do this later. I can't wait to see how it looks. It's gonna go right in the corner of the TV stand just because like it gets pretty dark there at night. And here's what it looks like. Oh, what's that black thing? Lavender. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Short bread. Mmm. 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 Good aftertaste. Okay, well, Thomas and I actually have dinner plans. So I'll and then I think I might meet up with some work friends afterwards. So I'll see you guys when we, when we build this. But it might be, like, late at night. Happy Friday. Yep. I just did not vlog for the rest of the night. I went to the happy hour and then I just stayed out and yeah, that's where we are. So happy Friday regardless. We're working from home today. Also, Thomas put together the lamp while I was at my happy hour last night and I just need to show you guys because it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, look at it. Wow. I think it makes actually a really big difference because the lighting is pretty good with the floor to ceiling windows, but it actually does get kind of dark in this area. So now we just have light in this corner and it's so pretty. I think this is from the brand Bright Tech from Amazon and it had really good reviews. I love like the gold tone of it. It's like that antique brass tone and it's three bulbs, which is really nice. I also did get an email that the dining table is going to be delivered today. So that's really good. Jerry's actually coming over because he's visiting this weekend. So I'm just gonna make Thomas and Jerry put that together because I am not doing that. Hello, oh my gosh, look at how nice the place is looking in the mirror with the, with the lamp, with the matching desks. Oh my gosh, everything is just so, I love this place so much. Once we get the dining table, and then I need to get two more chairs, but once that's done, that's how everything's looking. I can't wait to get everything and just like have it all be done. Also, these chairs are so nice. I'm not kidding you guys. I think they're really comfortable and I think that they like look very expensive and feel very expensive and it was less than $100 for one, which is really hard to find. So yeah, okay. Well, I just wanted to say hello. I'm not even gonna say good morning. It's like one or two right now, so. Good afternoon, but happy Friday. And yeah, I'll show you guys hopefully when the dining table comes, but I'm like obsessed with the lamp. It's so pretty. Ew. I've been thinking about good times. So tell me all your words are. Welcome to my new house. What is it? Do you like it though? It's so much bigger. No. Oh my god. I'm on that car.
Oh my gosh, I love it. What do you think, Thomas? I like it. Yeah, that looks good from this view. It looks way better. It does? Okay. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh! Now I just need more chairs. But they, it even matches well, I think. Oh my God, it's so pretty. I was scared it was gonna be too big, Thomas. But I actually think it's like the perfect size. Showing Justine and Justin the place. Wow. I know, a lot of natural light, the big windows and stuff. Yeah, it's pretty much done. Yeah, we're just waiting on two more dining table chairs. We got really lucky that like the old thing yeah. works there. Cause that used to be my bedroom. <laughs> Do you like it, baby? Aw, oh, you're a big boy. Yay! <laughs> so nice. nice Your double desk looks so good together. I know, because it's yeah. the same one. <laughs> Tomato basil soup. Ziti. Mom's famous ziti. You can steam some corn, some garlic bread, and some cut up watermelon. Ooh. Mom, everyone loves your food. Everyone was commenting on your food on the moving vlog. Oh, thank you. <laughs> That is so funny, Thomas. <laughs> okay, we're back at my old apartment right now. Justine is here. Say hi. And Justine's gonna go pick up the bar cart. So Thomas, as you guys saw, took down the plant. It is literally like a jungle in there. It's crazy, but this is all the stuff that I'm gonna take home. And it's actually not that much, but the bar cart Justine is gonna take to her current apartment now. So, okay. Hi guys. Okay, I am not good at finishing off vlogs, weekly vlogs like this. I basically had to rush this morning because my sister and my mom, my brother-in-law were here. So we got lunch and then we went to my old apartments so that they could pick up the plant, which you guys saw, and my old bar cart, which my sister's taking for her plants. So I feel like this whole week was totally chaotic, especially today, but I'm just gonna go ahead and end the vlog off here. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me a week in my life, settling into this apartment. I feel like, honestly, you guys, this apartment is really, really close to actually being like fundamentally done. We just need two more dining chairs. We're gonna take the old TV stand home this weekend. And yeah, and then we just have to make like the finishing touches, get the neon light. I kind of want to put up the mirror and just like all the finishing things. But I feel like actually today, Saturday, I feel like I'm actually settled in almost or like beginning to feel settled in. And it took a little bit of time. Like it's literally the end of July and we moved in July 17th. So I hope you guys know that if you're moving, it does not take one or two days. It doesn't even take one or two weeks. I probably won't feel fully settled until like a couple months, but what matters to me and what I wanted to like prioritize the most was just furnishing this place and feeling like I can relax in it. That's a long winded way of saying thank you guys for coming along this week in my life and make sure you guys are subscribed if you're not already. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video, but until then, miss you already.